Chronic obstructive pulmonary disease is a chronic inflammatory lung disease that obstructs airflow from the lungs. It is primarily caused by long-term exposure to irritating gases or particulate matter, most often from cigarette smoke. Given this background, it is important to address the question, is COPD contagious? And that is what we're going to discuss in this quick video. To give a quick answer, no, COPD is not contagious. This means it cannot be spread from person to person through physical contact, airborne particles, or any other method of transmission that is typically associated with infectious diseases. The causes of COPD are largely environmental and lifestyle related. The most significant risk factor is long-term cigarette smoking, which accounts for the majority of COPD cases. Other risk factors include exposure to secondhand smoke, air pollution, occupational dust and chemicals, and in some cases, genetic factors like a deficiency in alpha-1 antitrypsin, a protein that protects the lungs. The development of COPD is a progressive process that occurs over many years. Inhaled pollutants and irritants cause inflammation and damage to the lung tissue, leading to the narrowing and obstruction of the airways. This results in symptoms such as chronic cough, mucus production, and difficulty breathing. Over time, the lungs lose their ability to efficiently exchange oxygen and carbon dioxide, leading to further health complications. While COPD itself is not contagious, some infections that exacerbate COPD symptoms, such as bacterial or viral respiratory infections, can be spread from person to person. These infections can worsen the conditions of someone with COPD, leading to increased symptoms and potentially severe health issues. For individuals with COPD, it is crucial to avoid exposure to respiratory infections, practice good hygiene, and stay up to date with vaccinations, such as the flu shot and pneumococcal vaccine, to prevent infections that could lead to exacerbations. Managing COPD involves a combination of lifestyle changes, medications, and sometimes surgical interventions. Smoking cessation is the most effective way to prevent the progression of COPD and improve the overall quality of life for those diagnosed with the disease. Other management strategies include pulmonary rehabilitation, which incorporates exercise training, nutritional advice, and education, as well as the use of bronchodilators and corticosteroids to relieve symptoms. But as previously mentioned, COPD is not a contagious disease. It is a result of prolonged exposure to harmful substances, particularly tobacco smoke, and is influenced by genetic and environmental factors. While the disease itself cannot be transmitted from person to person, individuals with COPD must take precautions to protect themselves from respiratory infections that can worsen their condition. Effective management and preventive measures can help mitigate the impact of COPD and improve the quality of life for those affected. If you want to support the channel, please like and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it. And there should be some other helpful videos popping up on your screen right about now that I think you will enjoy. And just a quick reminder, we are not doctors. This video is for informational purposes only. Thank you so much for watching. Have a blessed day. And as always, breathe easy, my friend.